G'day, how's it going? Orewa, Brody Des, here with your Friday playthroughs in Yakuza 0, a game that came out in 2015, made by Ruga to Gotoku and Sega, pretty much the same people that made uh, Judgment. They also made this wonderful series known as Yakuza, which started, I think, like, pretty much around, like, in the early 2000s, I think. In the on the original PlayStation 2, this is where they started the series, and well, as you may see, it's taken off into one of the most interesting franchises in all video games, at least to me. Um, uh, this is Yakuza Zero, which is meant to be a prequel, um, as it came out in 2015, and the first game came out in like yeah, early 2000. As I said, um, but thankfully they made it so that you can either play the first Yakuza, which is now known as Yakuza Kawami, uh, which is like they made a remade version of that. But you can make you can play that, or you can play Yakuza Zero. Either way, they made it so that you can play either game and make that be your first game. So that's a good thing. But I'm a person where I see a prequel, I've got to play that first. That's going to be the first game for me in a series, so... And thankfully they made it so that you can play Yakuza 0 as your first main game. It follows two main characters that you pretty much will see throughout um, the Yakuza series. Kazuma Kiru and Goro Majima. And we'll see how their story unfolds, as this is their origin story being told here. So yeah, let's see how it goes. And I do apologise if it if I sound a little bit weird. I had just had a tooth taken out. Thankfully, I don't think you could see it. It's right at the back here. But I recently just got it taken out. So if I sound a little bit weird, if I sound a little bit lispy or sound a bit off, I do apologise. I'm readjusting to how I normally should speak with, you know, tooth out. But, and also, I do have my aircon on. It's Australia, I mean, in Australia, it's uh, summer. So it can get very hot here in Australia. And I got my aircon on. It's on silent, so hopefully my mic won't pick it up. It shouldn't at any point, so. Just in case if it does, you know, reason for it. But, anyways, let's get stuck into it before I ramble on any further. Let's get stuck into Yakuza Zero. And of course, it'll be in Japanese audio and English subtitles and yeah I'll keep it easy because I'm still fairly new to Yakuza the combat system as I remember is fairly similar to uh, Judgment but they have little slight tweaks to it so it's best for me to start off in easy and yep here we go And if you like what you see, feel free to hit the like button or subscribe so you can see more. <laughs> この町で喧嘩になるちゃんと相手を選べ大金持ち歩いてる時は特にな<音声><音声> 
さすびら切ったってタクシー捕まんないんだからいやだもういいから拡大出してよじゃあさプラザのスイートでも取るよだから俺と朝までねねねおいちょっと待てよこれ おい、てめえ。ぶつかっといて何しかとこいてんだよ。ちゃんと謝れっつんだよ。土下座しろ、土下座。おい。よしよ。よせ。あ。あ。え、その Damn right. <laughs> don't pick a fight. Don't pick a fight with me, or a yakuza, or simply a guy that has blood on his face. You don't pick a fight with them. よ頼んでおいた仕事どう終わりましたちょっと封筒がこのままでいいすかそんなこと気にしないでいい剥き出しだろうが金は金だからね道島組さんは仕事早くて助かるよはいこれ約束の一割ご苦労さん で、これは俺からの気持ちねいや、それは鳥藩が常識のこのご時世安い取り分でやってもらってんだ普通なら本職の人にこんな安い額の取り立て頼めないからねでも同年代のガキどもが万札ちらつかせてタクシー乗る時
ヤクザには誰かを幸せにすることなんてできないんすかね<笑>さあな俺はヤクザになったことねえからわからねえまあ気が変わったらいつでも連絡してくれじゃあ金貸しが偉そうにめんどくせうん I guess we'll soon find out how much is worth being a Yakuza As Yakuza Zero, and as uh, Kazuma Kido, one of the main characters of this game, uh, Abound by Oath, Chapter One. Mm. I wonder what that oath is. Cool intro. Unfortunately, we don't have the actual intro. It's a bit dubbed because I think the actual Japanese version has an actual song to it. But I don't mind the dubbed version. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Oh, this is where Nishiki said he'd meet me. I guess I beat him here. Huh. Oh. Seven two four one zero six. Huh? That's a code for what you're up to. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for your slow ass to show up. <laughs> May as well look around and see if I can find him. Fine, Nishiki Yama, a good old mate. Apparently, he must be here somewhere. Let's go. I don't see him, so I guess we we'll have to look around for him. Meanwhile, pretty much getting lost in the very lighty city of Cabocho. Not sure if that's a word for it, but I make it up a word. <laughs> Running shakedowns on our turf? Somebody needs to set them straight before they try anything really stupid. Yeah, alright, we're going to sort them out. Hey, we're going to stop them for bullying this poor dude. Yeah, that's right, I'm coming. What's this? Oh, you're a ここからはうちの組の島なんだな。カムロ町を歩き慣れている連中なら、この辺りでバカをしねえ。なんだと？ヤクザが偉そうに説教されてんじゃねえぞ。<笑> 
Oh, okay, we're gonna fight, eh? Hey, we gonna fight? All right, the street hooligans. You don't want to mess with me, do you? Attack with rush combos. Press a uh, square repeatedly to perform a rush combo. This is the most basic method of attack in battle. All right, let's do it. Kick their ass. Like this, like that, like that, and that. We kick and punch until they're dead. Perfect, I'd say. All right, that's a basic method of fighting. Knock down with a finishing blow. Press triangle uh, during a square combo attack to perform a finishing blow that knocks the enemy down. So the, the, the knockdown effect varies depending on the number of times the square was pressed. So try it in a few ways. All right. So I go do this and boom. All right, that's the finishing blow. One, eight, oi. One, two, and boom. Oh, uppercut. He's down. And oh, whack. Uh, the health guard. The yellow guard uh, on the top left indicates your health. Uh, the game will end if the yellow part is fully depleted. So keep an eye on your health at all times. If the guard, the gauge, uh, flashes red, it means that you're in very bad shape and should replenish your health immediately. Health recovery items are, oh uh, yeah, use uh, a recovery item or eat something at an eatery in order to increase my health a bit. All right, thank you for telling me that. As you see on the top left, I got the health guard. It's in orange. Uh, grab and attack the enemy. Press the uh, press circle near an enemy to grab them. If an enemy is guarding to block your attacks, grab them and uh, and then attack to deal damage. All right. So I grab you and I can punch you. Or I can headbutt you and then I can do this and I can throw you. Pretty much just like Judgment. It's perfect, I love it. Especially later on, you'll get a bit crazy with the um, throw mechanic. It's absolutely fun. Now let's teach these punks a lesson. Your training is now complete. It's time to wipe the smirks off your opponent's faces. If you get hit, you can strike back right away using the square, triangle, or circle. This is called an absolute this is called a resolute counter. You can gain money by knocking down or defeating enemies. Depending on how you do it, you might get a bonus too. So try a range of different moves. All right, that's perfect. And something that you don't see is the money. Sorry, I am covering that up. There's probably the other thing that might be covering up, but I'll probably keep you in check of what's going on in there. With the money. At the moment, we're at 30,000 yen, so not much at all. That's like about three hundred dollars, I think American. I'm not too sure about that, but yeah. Anyways, let's teach these punks a lesson. Stally. Oh, oh, no, I'm down. I didn't mean to get down. I mean to pick your ass instead. No, ow, ow, I forget all the mechanics. So excuse me, as it take a while to learn everything, but do well like that, and you can throw you down, sweep in the legs. All right, one, two, and boom. There we go. You, bandana, go down, mate. And you, you should not pick a fight with a Yakuza. This will teach you, won't it? Will it? Right. Oh, a knockout blow. Perfect, the way it should be. Now, you wanna do it again? Round two. I got a Zyosha Nina Nishki. Ome eats him at the Tatemo Conegara. Machia was a spoka sereta domota. Gakuda Omega Nagana Conegara coy at the Jigan Subushitan Janega. She matsubushini can cut te. Otonashko Heresy, the Mikitro, Gakija, Armeji. Kill me. 